Oops, our grocery order is ready. Time to pick up the groceries. Hello, we're on our way to pick up our grocery order. This is one of the things I discovered um, that really saves me a lot of time. I do my grocery shopping on my phone on Friday night. We discuss it with the whole family, uh, what we want to eat that week. And I pick out all the groceries. I actually talk to some of Lynn's aides on some of the things that she might be uh, running out of. It could be hand soap, it could be shampoo, it could be whatever. And uh, I add that to the order during the week. And uh, I pick it up on Saturday. It saves me a lot of time. And I need it because I don't have much time. Uh, by the way, if you're new to the channel, I'm Jonathan. And I'm a caregiver for my wife, Lynn, who has a brain injury. And I'm not sure what we're really going to be doing today. Uh, I think it's sort of a day in the life type of thing. Um, I know this is the week of Thanksgiving, so happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Maybe this video is about things that we're thankful for. Okay, so we've just picked up the groceries, which as I mentioned is a huge time saver for me. So I don't have to spend time going up and down grocery aisles and waiting in the checkout. It also helps me with uh, budgeting, because I'm not uh, enticed to, to buy things uh, that I really don't need, like baked goods and you know, delicious things that they always put right up front. So, uh, yeah, so we're going to head home and uh, we'll see what happens next. Okay, so now we're going to unload the groceries. Uh, by the way, it's uh, very cold out. I think it was in the teens this morning. And I think it might be up to a balmy 20 degrees right now. But the sun is shining. So that I'm thankful for. And of course, the thing I'm most thankful for is this person right here, Linny, who I almost lost almost eight years ago, but you survived, didn't you? Survived because of you. No, you survived because you're tough. That's why. <laughs> so, I'm the most thankful for that. Okay, who? look who's next to me. Lynn. It's Lynn. Where are we going, Lynn? Yeah, we're gonna go to the mall today. Go we're gonna, Christmas. Kind of Christmas shopping, kind of. Well, we're gonna be looking at some uh, new Christmas lights. We kind of need some new lights. I gotta buy some lights, anyways, for a Christmas tree that we auction off for our Boy Scout troop. And uh, I said I would get the uh, the lights for it. So we're gonna get that, and it's a good excuse to get Lynn out of the house. And uh, it is, it's an awful cold day, but it's sunny, it's a pretty day. So we're, uh, we're gonna go to the mall, we're gonna go to Target, and we're gonna take a look at some of the stuff they have there. What are you, what are you thankful for? For the care I receive. From who? Jonathan and Justin and Amaya H. They are a back here. Yeah, they are just, just 25 or 12 a dollar. Yeah. The ones that are. Well, we have well, some. We have we have lots of those type decorations. We're looking at some Jr. other type things to do. How about this? I don't know. We're looking for something different. Yeah. Merry Christmas. So look at the little, look, look at the little nativity. That's kind of a cute one. That's like a little kid's nativity, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Look, John. What? It's the holiday of brew. Holiday brew. Holiday brew. Except that I already picked out my holiday brew. A 
rainbow poop Christmas ornament. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, well it's time to uh, head home and I just thought of something else that I'm thankful for. You guys, our viewers, because without our viewers we wouldn't have a channel. So thank you for watching. I'm thankful for this too. One of our aides gave us the recipe. Lemon butter chicken. It's delicious. If you want the recipe, let me know. Now to try out my holiday brew. It's Black Forest Cake made by our local brewery, Saranac. And I'm anxious to give it a shot. It says it has chocolate, vanilla, and cherries in it. I don't usually like stuff like that in my beer, but let's see how it tastes. Um, you know what? That's good. All right. Lynn's eating her pistachios. You love pistachios, don't yeah. you? Yeah, I got her some pistachios. Um, we're, we've been talking about things that we're thankful for. You're obviously thankful, thankful for, for pistachios. For pistachios. Yeah. <laughs> You're and thankful. I love, you. I love you too. But I was thinking about this, and one of the things that I'm the most thankful for, and most people are, but they take it for granted, is freedom. We're thankful for freedom. And what does that mean? What does freedom mean to you? We can do whatever we want. Yeah, you can do what you want, right? Freedom to make choices and uh, be able to do things that you want to do. And that's something that people with disabilities lose. They lose that freedom. That's a scary thing. So what we do is Lynn lets me know what she wants. You go horseback riding, but you let me know what you want to do, and I execute it, and I, I uh, follow through with some of your wishes, right? And that's how we get through it. So freedom is what I am probably one of the most, one of the things I'm the most thankful for. The thing that I'm the most thankful for is family. How about you? Family. Besides the pistachios. Family. And here's something that I'm very thankful for, Lynn's health. In fact, this is a picture of her just the other day getting her pacemaker defibrillator checked out and everything is perfect. Hey, remember that this is the last week that you have a chance to leave a comment in order to be in the running to win Lynn's painting. We'll be drawing it on November 30th, so be sure to leave a comment. Happy Thanksgiving, and, and we'll, we'll see you next time, time on, on The Wind Life.